Hey! <laughs> Trying to find a different way to start the videos over there. Hey. Hang on. Dog alert. Right. Sorry about that. Right. So yeah, people have been asking me, and they genuinely have. That's not just a uh, segue. How to do this one. And is there a tutorial for it? I don't know. I've Someone posted a photo of it. I bloody well fell in love with it. And I thought, let me take it off to show you. I don't know if you can see that. So I thought, right, I'm gonna show you how to do it. Let's have a go. So it's made up of, where's my pointy thing? Mobiuses, Mobii. I'm not quite sure what a, a plural of a Mobius is. Mobii. And then joined with a couple of rings into one of these bad boys. It's essentially helm weave with an extra ring larger than the initial helm ring, for want of a better phrase, around the outside of it. That's all really it is. But it does give a really nice, nice look to it, doesn't it? Okay, so what I'm using, 20 AWGs for the smallest ring, 1 18th in British, 3.25 millimeters. I say British, other people use millimeters too. Then we've got, again, 20 AWG 5 millimeters, which is a 316 Imperial. And then for the large ring, which is the one that goes around the outside there, I'm using these, which are 19 SWG, 6.6 .6 millimeters, one quarter as an Imperial. So that's our three ring sizes. And that's all we really need. Oh, and also you will need a clasp if you're making it into a bracelet. Always good to have a class. If you want to sort of pre-check your possibility for success, the thing about helm weave is it's basically the small ring of helm needs to fit perfectly within the large ring of helm. In this pattern, we're going to call that the medium ring. But that is essentially helm weave. You need to be able to get the small ring to sit securely and not moving around, just a perfect fit within the, the large ring. So as long as you've got that, then you know you're on the right track. Now to get the wheel shape, you wanna add a ring that goes perfectly around that one. So if your three rings that you're working with for this project do that, then that's good, you want that. Okay, so that's that little thing. Let's move those out of the way there. Okay, so to start, I'm gonna use my clasp to hold on to, and I'm gonna put a small ring through it, like so. Then two of the medium rings, let's go ones that aren't closed. Two medium rings through that one. Like so. Then we're gonna take two small ones and put them through those medium rings. like that and then we're going to do the first no we're not I'm lying we're going to add another two medium rings <laughs> keeping you on your toes one So at the moment we're just doing a helm. Might be being a bit finicky with my closures, but that's because there's quite a lot of strips of spring back with 19 SWG. Right, so we've got two mediums, two smalls, and then two mediums. Now we want to do the first circling ring of helm weave. So take a medium ring. We want to go between the first two medium rings like that. See, so he's actually going... Oops, let me show you again. 
like that, look. So he's going between the first two and he's circling those two small rings there. So once you're satisfied that's in place, we want to do the same to these two, these two medium rings here. So a bit fiddly to start off. I find folding it that one backwards helps. And then do him up. So what you've got is your two medium rings, your small rings, and then a medium ring circling the small rings, sandwiched in between those there. Perfect. So that was normally how you, that is then how you would do helm. You'd stick us two small rings in and you'd start the process again. But what we want to do to make this wheel, this really cool thing, ha ha ha, is do what we've just done with a larger ring. So put him in there. And underneath that one. Now that wasn't the smoothest explan uh, example, so I will show you again, obviously. But what you have is that, look. I love that, I think that's awesome. So I'll show you another one of them in a minute. Let's do the next bit first. It'll be a bit easier to hold now one is in and won't be so shaky. So we wanna put two small rings in there now. One, two, and now we want to do a Mobius part. To do a Mobius, we want three of the medium rings. Okay, I'm going to put the first one in there. And with a Mobius, you basically like got three rings of the same size and they're all going through each other. So take a ring, put it through that one, but then put it through the two small ones as well. And close it up. You can obviously make the Mobius in advance if you want to and then just attach it with two small rings. But I like to do it as I go because it's quicker. So that's your first one in place, and you can see that the two, one goes through the other one. It's neat. You want to do the same again. Put another ring through those two. Through the smalls. And close. And then they'll fit through each other three like that. So there's your Mobius. Now if you've got that far, you can do this thing, you can finish it, you don't need me. But I'll do another one anyway. So we're going to add two small rings now to that Mobius. One. Oh, I am so shaky. I really need to eat before I do these videos. And then we're going to start with our helm again. So take the medium ring, place him through the two smalls. And then another one, let's take an open one. Through there again. Okay. Two smalls now. One. Two. Two mediums.
like that. So we're on the helm part now. So we want to, oop, knocked my glasses off then. That was daft. So we now want to do that circling ring, orbital ring, which is going to go around these two small ones here. So we want to put him between those medium rings there. Like that, see? And then we also want to put in between those two medium rings there. Fold that one over for easy access. And I'm just going to tidy up my closure because I don't want to be scratching myself. There you go. That one's in. And then the addition of the large ring is required then to make the helm a bit special. So I'm going to do the same thing again. He's going to go around there. He's going to go under that one. And we're going to close him up. Like that. Ta-da! So I'll do one more Mobius to show you. Two small rings now in those mediums. One. Two of them, and then take a medium ring, and through the small rings, and then another medium. Again, to do Mobius, we pick up the one medium. Go through the two small mean uh, to the smalls and close him up. And then we want to take a third one. Pick up those two again, put him through the two small ones, and do it up. And there's your Mobius again. And then all you just need to do is keep repeating until you get a beautiful bracelet like so. So there we are. Ta-da! So, by the way, if you um, happen to enjoy that and you appreciate what I do, then please like the video and uh, subscribe if you want to see more. Um, and I used to get on my tits when I'd see people asking that. Don't forget to like and subscribe. But now I'm doing this, I've realized the absolute importance of it. So if you want to show some support, show me some love, bitches, then yeah, like and subscribe.